about to begin. Anywhere a garden grows, from the tulips to the merry-go-old, every little creature holds a song within its knees. So listen up and you know by it. Your voice, when you refine it, it takes many different notes to make a harmony. So call me delighted to see you all. Harry is the best fashion designer in Wonderland. He makes all my aprons. Clothes are a splendiferous way to express yourself. It's like art you can wear. <laughs> and makes you feel good. Think you can help me make a new cape for Mama? Thinking is what I do best with this. Cast your eyes on my treasure chest of fashion. Curious. Ooh, these treasures remind me of my art supplies back at the palace. Then working on the cape should be a piece of cake. Want to start? Yes, but now I have a new problem. What should the cape look like? What would you do without me? Teapots? When I'm designing a new piece, I start by thinking about the person who's going to wear it. The queen. Who is she really? Paint me a picture, but with words. Well, Mama loves red roses. Oh, and being queen, of course. <laughs> spill it, spill it, tell me more! She also loves playing croquet and salsa dancing. All these details sound like ingredients in a recipe. So true, Alice. It's our first step in making a cake fit for a queen. What's our second step? A little recon! We need to see the queen in action. But the cape is a surprise. Won't it be ruined if the queen sees us? We'll go in disguise. <laughs> Mustaches? Really? <laughs> Has the queen ever seen you in a mustache? Uh, well... No. Then we are dressed for success. Will you fashionable fellas get our supplies ready while we hop on by the Queen's place? You bet your ears we will. All right, girls. The palace awaits. Uh, why are we hiding behind a bush? The Queen loves red, but not cherry red, not lobster red, rose red. We have to find the exact shade for her cape. That's the one. We're off to a royal start. The queen loves her croquet. Then she's going to love what I have up my sleeve. Okay, now, find the ones that remind you of those croquet critters. Hmm, this one. Ooh, this one. Oh, we've been spotted. Quick, don't make a scene. Run! <laughs> I love the 
the smell of fresh baked confusion. What's on your mind, Alice? Oh, Cheshire, the Queen offered to make me royal baker. Woo! My! You must be head over heels. I'm honored. But Fergie thinks I won't have time for the bakery. Rosa thinks I can make time for friends. Hattie and Cookie think. Up, 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 up. What do you think, Alice? I've been so busy thinking about what everyone else thinks, I haven't thought to think what I think. Have you thought to ask the Tweedles? They can help. What are the Tweedles? You mean, who are the Tweedles? Stop the landing! Tweedles! Have you met Alice? <laughs> How do you do? Don't think we've had the pleasure. <laughs> Alice, this is Tweedle Do and Tweedle Don't. <laughs> Wonderland's decision-making helpers. <laughs> Don't worry, Alice. We're here to help. I'll leave you to it. Ta-ta! Help how exactly? We'll, we'll show, show you! you. <laughs> so you've got yourself a problem and you don't know what to do. You've got to pick between two choices, but it isn't clear to you. You look high, you look low. Talk to everyone you know. But have you considered? Maybe you should. What? Ask the Tweedle! I know what you should do. Me too. Ask a Tweedle. Tweedle, yes. Tweedle, no. Tweedle, maybe. Tweedle, so. Clarify a point of fact. Are they ladybugs or beetles? You know what you could do. I do not. Ask the Tweedle. <laughs> when a question's got you puzzled and you need to find your voice. The best helping hands in Wonderland? Well, that's an easy choice. Hey, you know what she should do? I can tell you what I do. Let's say it on the couch. Time to bake. What's the first step? Toss them all into my bowl. Then I can mix them into a batter. First, some soaring saffron. Uh-oh. We just painted the ceiling. <gasps> That's going to be a doozy to get out. Maybe we should just start with the jumping garlic instead? Oh, hey, come back here. I will not be out hot. Yeah! Oh, carrots, these ingredients are quick. Then we've got to be quicker. Huh. Lemons, leap in your way! Uh, uh, <laughs> Jumping garlic, coming in hot! <laughs> Soaring saffron, falling from new heights! Uh, that's everything. Oh! I love the smell of saffron and garlic in the morning! Mmm, mmm, dandy and daisy really know their flavors! Hey! Watch out! Ah. Soaring saffron soars high, jumping garlic jumps far! Oh! Double the ingredients means double the bounce! Then we're gonna need a bigger bowl! Mm, mixing bowl powering up! Yeehaw! Live and drop! Yeah! Oh, it's working! It's not working! A little help here! Buttery biscuits! Wow! Let's do this every day! I'm slipping! Alice, we're here to pick up... my stems. Lemon Drop, you gotta turn off that watch or you'll burst both our bubbles. How are you staying so cold? I take a breath, flip my pages, and slow down. <laughs> because as far as I can remember, this is my first time floating in a bubble above Wonderland. And I don't want to miss it. Always in a hurry. 
Shuffle it is the one day a year the cards really let their guard down and have fun. Pardon me, Your Highness. This little fella got a bit carried away. <laughs> <laughs> it's your day today. I look forward to the card guard shuffle all year, especially the dinner. Want to see what we're having? Hmm. Do I? Oh, who am I kidding? Of course I want to see what's for dinner. It's... Thimbleberry dumplings? Yep, with spicy mustard sauce. Oh, well, I really appreciate all your hard work. Aren't you excited? I'm not a fan of thimbleberries or dumplings or spicy mustard. I'm more of a sweet and sour god myself. Oh, dear. But some of the gods love spicy. You'll surely be a hit with them. Gods! Croquet commands! Set her fan over to Mama. I thought all card guards love thimbleberry dumplings and spicy mustard sauce. I'm sure some of them do. Or at least three and does. It's always a party with thimbleberry dumplings. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> but I want all the card guards to feel celebrated. Even if one doesn't like the meal we made, it won't be the party they deserve. The croquet match just started. We have time to make something else. But what? Hattie, Fergie, you guys up for a mission? Are we ever? Absolutely! Rosa and I will finish setting up. You two go ask the guards about their favorite foods. We'll call it Mission Delicious. Thimbleberry dumplings, yay or nay? Happen to know that guard's favorite foods, do you? <laughs> After making the wicket at five, rush both out of bounds to set up the strong position for attacking the ally next turn. Any questions? Yes, one question. Any dinner requests? Good news, Alice. You were right to be concerned. All of the cards celebrate with different foods. How is that good news? Hmm, good point. Well, at least we have requests now. Cold finger foods, hot fork and knife foods. Not too hot and not too cold chunky soup you eat with a spork. Oh, crumbs. Those foods couldn't be more different. <sighs> what can I bake that everyone will like? Whoa, it's so sparkly. Oh, isn't it? The garden is blooming with healing ingredients that can help Wonderlanders feel better. Just like this dewdrop. And you use them to brew your soothing teas? Sure do. Take a look. Here's where I keep all my pollen puffs, dewdrops, honeycomb. It's like my pantry. 
But I've never made anything like this before. My teas help soothe any Wonderland worry, from a thistle who's lost his whistle to a camp firefly with a hoarse voice. Oh, uh, there he is now. Curiouser and curiouser. I've got just the brew for those nays. Would you like to help, Alice? I'd love to. I'm learning so much from our lessons. All we have to do is follow my recipe. I certainly know how to do that. There's nothing I love more than making my garden friends feel better. It's what these petals were born to do. If rumblebees should scrape their knees and feel oh so blue, they'll buzz to me straight away for a special floral brew. With my teapot at the ready, my petals nice and steady, I'll help those Wonderland walls. Paws are rose, always knows. If Rosh should chill a daffodil with a shiver and shake, I'll steep them all in sunshine till the colors reawake. With my teapot at the ready, my petals nice and steady, I'll help those Wonderland walls. Paws are rose. My heart in every tea and add a dash of love times three. So every step can lean on me. With my teapot at the ready, your petals nice and steady, I'll help, help those wonderland walls. No matter how the wind blows, cause a rose, a rose always are precious. So, Lemon Drop, what are we making? I want to try something I've never done before. Something to really surprise Cheshire. Oh, cumbersome cucumber sandwiches? Okay, million melon ball menagerie? Nope, I want to cook without a recipe. Try baking freestyle. I have so many ideas. Glad you both like the plan. Since Fergie and Hattie are keeping Cheshire busy, it gives us time to stretch our baking muscles. All right, let me show you some spices I've been saving for a special occasion. <laughs> oh, well, that was fun. Now to sniff out the surprise. <laughs> I think it's a really great idea to make it a surprise so Cheshire doesn't expect anything. <gasps> so the surprise dinner is for me. How thoughtful. I must find out what they're making. Can't talk now, Dinah. Curiosity has got a hold of this cat. All those spices gave me even more ideas for our freestyle dish. Oh, we've just scratched the surface of seasoning possibilities. A cat's eye view of the action. <laughs> okay, don't shoot. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yes, Dinah. I'm excited to make Cheshire surprise dinner, too. <laughs> <laughs> Aha! A dusty disguise. Perfect. You again? This one? Or this one? Hmm, I can't decide. <gasps> what in Wonderland? <coughs> Looks like some kitty tracks their itty bitty paws in the flower. <coughs> oh, while you're down there, pumpkin, get us another scoop of flour. Who put on the tunes? Yeah, but a more important question... Can you crank it up, Alice? Oh, yeah. I love making to a beat. I thought Bansting and I would be together forever. Abuelita! We saw how sad you were after the competition. Maybe these will help. Mm, delicioso. What are these? 
confidence cream puffs. We thought they'd help you get back to your dancing self. Oh, I don't know. When 3N won today, I realized I'm all out of moves. Your Majesty, you're truly the best dancer we know. Yeah, no one dances like you. Everyone in Wonderland knows dancing is your thing. Really? Everyone? Of course. And you said it this morning. Nothing fills your heart more than dancing. It is true. I had no idea my dancing meant this much to you. Mm. Hey, I think the screen pops are working. I suddenly feel like dancing! <laughs> Dancer. See, this much is true. So when the music fills these halls, then dancing's what I'll do. And once the skin gets going, the whole palace dances too. This feeling can't be wrong. The dance floor is where I belong. I feel the rhythm in my feet. Now it's time to bring the heat. Don't delay another day. I'm a sauce of the fears away. There's a fire in my soul. Pretty soon I'm on a roll When I hear the music start I've got to follow the beat Of my heart Giving up is never the answer When you have the heart of a dancer So when I hear the music start I've got to follow the beat Okay, Dinah, let's sniff out that fluffle. My first fluffle hunt. We're whisker distance from the action. <laughs> There's the white roads. Give it a whip. Oh, no fluffle, but we must be close. <laughs> In all my pages, I've never seen a better fluffle hunter. Dinah lost the scent. And I don't see any girly red mushrooms. Wait. Another white rose? It's behind us. Fluffle. No smoothie on this one. Not this time. Hearts and spades, you found it. I hereby declare Alice this year's royal Fluffle champion. Congrats, Alice. It fills my heart with joy to give you the Fluffle. Finders keepers. <laughs> it's a dream come true. Now for one more dream. We're thrilled you're all here to celebrate Hattie's on birthday. Oh. <laughs> Hattie, you're growing older, wiser, and mastering more hat flips by the minute. <laughs> we couldn't be 
more proud of the dashing haberdasher you're becoming. So to mark this occasion, Harry and I made you something extra special. <gasps> A traditional hat or shoe hat. I love it. Thank you. Oh, go ahead. Go, go. Try it on. Do it. Put it on. Go. Oh, I want to wear it every day. But I wear my hat every day. What if... It's like a hat for your foot. Brilliant. Iconic. Dad Hatter, I thought you said a shoe hat is a hat, not a shoe. Yeah, it is. But I guess that doesn't mean Hattie can't wear it however he wants, right? Exactly. As long as it makes him happy, then we're happy too. That's called having attitude. <laughs> Let's show him. You gotta live your life with attitude. Put yourself in the hatter mood. What others think doesn't matter, dude. That's called attitude. Yeah! Yeah! Attitude. You like to be you, right? Got a clear point of view, right? Uh -huh. You love what you do, right? You support your friends too, right? You let happiness lead. Yeah! Help others succeed. Yeah! So we're all agreed. Yeah! Let your smile be free. Gotta live your life with attitude Filling your heart with gratitude Sharing your positive attitude, attitude. That's called attitude you Gotta live your life with attitude Put, Put yourself in that hatter mood Filling your heart with gratitude That's called attitude Yeah! 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 Attitude! 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 That's called attitude It's an honor to have you here, Cookie. It's, it's not every day we get to learn from a royal book pick. We rabbits are big fans of your baking. We're here to help and, and watch and eat. <laughs> okay, today we'll be baking small cake, but we have to stay alert because the recipes for small cake and tall cake can be pretty similar. Oh, well, how similar? Oh, very similar. <laughs> Sift. Luckily, Alice always keeps me focused on one thing at a time. Um, but you're doing two things. I am? Yes, yes, I am. Uh-oh. Did we stir or sift? Oh, boy. Okay, if you're making small cake, you stir. Tall cake, you sift. Let's give it a stir, just to be sure. Mmm, oh. oh. tastes good. Good. Oh. Whoa, is this whoa, supposed to happen? Oh, rabbit incoming. They gotta move. Oh. 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 Hmm, let's see. Sea salt clamps. Cookie, which drawer is seafood again? Oh, <laughs> right. No cookie. Things sure aren't the same without her here, are they, Dinah? Oh, I'm glad she's on tour, but I miss her. She always knows what to do. Oh, that is one big rabbit. Oh, Dad, I think the house shrunk. Uh, no, son. You grow. Oh, shrimp scallops. Alice would know what to do. Thank Cookie. Cottontails! My cottontail! I'm running out of room in here! Quick, pass me those shrinking strawberries! Bergie, give me a lift! Open wide! Mm, mm, mm. Is it working? Oh, thank Garrett. <laughs> I'm me again! Oh, back to bunny size. <laughs> as good as small cake sounds. I <laughs> think we'll stick to carrots. When it comes to Christmas, we must obey the royal rule. As queen, I have a royal duty to uphold our regal ways. Such a change would be amiss. My heart is set on this. It's the royal Christmas rule. I'll dazzle you as host. Merry music will play. Yeah! 
swell My guests marvel as well At the greatest Christmas gift A night with me Wonderful feeling as we gather around the tree. My heart seems to swell, but I wonder as well what the greatest Christmas gift means to me. You see. Lovely affair. So every friend should be there. Isn't Christmas something to I never find my hat, and no one in Wonderland recognizes me ever again! You don't need a hat to be recognizable. There is no one else in Wonderland like you. But without my hat, I don't recognize myself. My trusty top hat, together wear one. Hats dance confetti, we always had fun. On my head, wherever I roam, always with me, so I feel Filled up to the brim Atop of my thoughts Each wonderful whim Morning, noon, and before I slept Tight with a hat on my head My dreams took flight Where can it be? Who can I be? Without my hat, I'm just not me Because at the heart of every matter It's the hat that makes the hatter Almost as much as I love baking! You're just in time, Cheshire. Will you make the sparkleberry shortcake, please? Oh, and it must be served with raspberry tall cake. Well, why is that? So everyone who eats it evens out. Not too tall and not too short. Ah, uh, honey flour, whirlpool butter, sparkleberries. What a delish dish! 
I'll only use the finest of each ingredient. Oh, no lemon drop. If you're stirring upside down, you gotta go right, right, left, not right, left, left. Oops, uh, how silly of me. Uh, I'm a bunny banana tree. <laughs> Let me help you with those. Cheshire, we're supposed to be baking the food, not eating it. I had to have a little nibble, Alice. How else can I find the very best berries? Well, we can't use any berries with Cheshire Cat nibbles, but I happen to know Captain Dodo likes blueberry shortcake just as much as Sparkleberry shortcake. And then let me try again. I promise on my stripes not to eat another berry. Perfect. The blueberries are in the pink cabinet. Oh no, not the blue one! Oh, away I go! Run away, villains! Whoa! What a page turner! Cheshire, that was amazing. No, oh, what can I say? I'm a natural in the kitchen. <laughs> I, uh, it just, uh, I didn't mean, would you look at the time? Better go, see ya, bye. Cheshire, wait, are you all right? Yo, I, a little help here. Oh, thanks, Snickerdoodle. Tick tock, we gotta clean up this mess and get back to baking. That's right, bingo waits for no one. <laughs> What's next? Seaweed souffle, but are you sure you're okay, Cookie? Uh-huh. Wait just a second. Oh, that's funny. My pages won't turn. Ooh, this is staple syrup. The stickiest syrup in Wonderland. Oh, I'll be fine as fudge. Just as soon as my pages dry. That was a lot of syrup, though. You won't be unstuck before the banquet. But but that means we can't read any of your recipes. <laughs> Please, I got you covered, cover to cover. I know these recipes like the back of my bookmark. Huh. Wh where's my bookmark? Uh. For croquet, let's schedule a night game. First, we've got some painting to do. Painting the roses red. Yes, we're painting the roses red. We dare not stop for ways to talk, so let the paint be spread. We're painting the roses red. We're painting the roses red. Oh, painting the roses red. Yes, we're painting the roses red. We dare not stop for ways to talk, so let the paint be spread. We're painting the roses red. Marvelous! Roses! Oh, well done, Snickerdoodle! Ah, oh, not a white rose in sight. Excellent work, guards. And you too, Queen Alice. Oh, it feels good to shovel things back into place. Thank you for believing in me. It was the easiest decision I've made in wonder years. Aha! This next swing will be my finest yet. <gasps> I'm on the edge of my cushions. You've got mail, Your Majesty. <laughs> <laughs> it's from Captain Dodo. <clears throat> it would be a swashbuckling pleasure to invite the royal family on a cruise aboard me ship today. <laughs> Can we please go? <laughs> Cruise with Captain Dodo sounds like a wonderful adventure. But if the royal family is at sea, who will be in charge of Wonderland? Excellent question. It must be someone trusted, caring, and clever. I must choose wisely. So I choose you, Alice. <gasps> Me? I heart that idea. <laughs> I'm flattered, <laughs> Your Heartness. But I don't know how to be queen. 
sure I'm in charge of the bakery. Wonderland is way bigger, though. It will be different. So you'll need a royal coaching. You start each day the royal way with a speech or two. Then praise the guards. They're all such cards. Be bold as you try something. My part to be brave and true. Brave and true. And the rose is red, won't lose my head. I'm ready now for my debut. Cause you're a queen, the crown's brightest of jewels. Is the woman who rules. She will be heard and seen. Go ahead and shine. If... Squash! <laughs> squash! Yeah, squash! If I could just... Celery! 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 <sighs> I guess you're busy today. Half sour pickle! Half sour... Uh, I don't see any pickles. Oh, my macaroons! That's right! A half sour pickle can only be found in Alice's great-grandmother's root cellar! A root cellar? It's a place underground where you store vegetables to keep them fresh. Ha-ha! <laughs> Bingo, bunny! Well, where is this root cellar? Oh, good question. I don't remember. Oh, crumbs. Now how are we going to finish the recipe? Tracking down that root cellar would be like trying to find a hidden treasure. <gasps> Did someone say treasure? Oh, I've had these treasure maps lying around my tree for wonder years. Maybe they can help? Do any of them mention a secret root cellar? Let's see. Hmm, map to the Queen's courtroom. Uh, no. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Ah, a map to Captain Dodo's long lost ship. Uh, no, but remind me to save that one for a rainy day. Aha, here it is. Your great grandmother's root cellar. Oh, <gasps> my shirt. Oh. But I bet you aren't interested. <laughs> Cheshire, this is exactly what we need to finish our recipe today. It is? Hold this, Gone. Is this map in some secret Wonderland language? It does seem a little curious. Well, it makes perfect sense to me. Perhaps I can be of assistance. <laughs> curious is Cheshire's specialty. Indeed. In fact, all things Wonderland are especially my specialty. It seems you're really in a bind. A missing pickle that you need to find. A treasure map, but you're gonna fall flat. Unless you see it from the eyes of a cat. Well, I can help you in a way. And I'm not just saying that because I wanted to play. You see, I know Wonderland. Like the stripes on my back. So stick with me. And this puzzle will crack. Whatever the weather, you can count on Cheshire. So let me be your guide. We can find the treasure and be back in time for tea. If you stick with me. I'm irreplaceable. Inescapable, unmistakably, fully capable, just you wait and see. Whatever the weather, you can count on Cheshire, so let me be your guide. We can find the treasure, but really only if you stick with me. We can find the treasure and be back in time for tea, if you stick with me. I still haven't gotten this gem corn pie right, though. But all these pies look perfect! That one's too tall, and that one's too small. And look how crumbly that one is. 
they're just not perfect enough for my first harvest day. Oh, they all look good enough to eat. <gasps> Can we at least give them away? That's a great idea. No point in letting food go to waste. Alice Pies, get them while they're fresh! Wow! What's the finding? Bye-bye, <laughs> not-so-perfect pies! Whew. How's it going, Alice? Oh, we miss you at the party. The only game left before dinner is the Big Backyard Hat Toss! We'll be there soon. We just have one final pie to bake. You've got my whiskers twitching. I can't wait to try it. But hurry, so you don't miss all the fun, Kay. Ooh, this one will add some zing to the hat toss. We have enough ingredients left for one more try. And just enough time, too! Oven, think you have one more pie left in you? <laughs> then let's roll. Fellas worked so hard that he's tuckered out. My perfect pie. It's ruined. Oh, don't worry, Sugar Plum. Everyone will understand. What really matters is it's time for Harvest Day dinner. <laughs> we better get going. When things look dark and you need a hand, you'll always have a friend here in Wonderland. Cause what you need is right next door. You've got lots to give. That light we will restore. So look at the bright side. We're spreading the sunshine. There's a top shelf idea. Are you sure you can handle it? This pizza is supreme. We got this. Don't worry, your whiskers. Okay, all you have to do is add the last three toppings, then hand it off to Oven. He'll take it from there. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Oh, we'll make this pizza so supreme, it'll knock the queen's crown off. Come along. The palace awaits. Let's see. Next, we need doorbell peppers. Row, row, ringing right here. Toasty tomatoes? Check. Peppered pickles, trumpet mushrooms, ruffled clover? Check, check, triple check. We got them all. Mmm, mmm. Doorbell peppers are delicious. But I don't know if I'd say they're supreme. I hear ya, bunny ears. Toasty tomatoes are good to eat and juggle. But to make this pizza supreme, maybe it needs more pizzazz. Alice did say the best part is adding any topping your heart desires. Last one to the pantry is a dancing dodo egg. Wow! Oh, no. Ooh, dodo eggs have pizzazz. Oh, maybe I'll add one of those. Wow! My tip top toppings are twist and shouts and tum tum fruit. <gasps> and rain watermelon. Gotta have one of those. Well, I'm thumping this pizza up with some singing siren honey, bubble sprouts, marshmallow flowers, ooh, and pineapple. 
pineapple on a pizza? That's brilliantly bonkers! Oh, time to make this pizza supreme! Pizza takes the hat! Oh, it's a Leaning Tower of Pizza. Oh, dear. And a rumbly one. Maybe we added too many toppings? Perfect! Now it's time to pizza party! All right. On the count of header. One, two, header! <laughs> Oh, no, 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 oh. If only we had more muscle! Ham to the rescue! Down the rabbit hole to Wonderland. 